Hello everyone, today I'll be reviewing the Zip Juke Bar 9750 Pro Dolby Atmos. I received the sound bar last year and have been using it since then. As I have used it for one year, I am able to give you the whole review of how this overall product works and sounds. I'll also be telling you about all the shortcomings that come with this box and how we had to deal with it. As you can see, we are now unboxing the home theater. The box comes with a white tone and it displays the sound bar, the two satellite rear speakers and the subwoofer along with the remote. After we unbox the soundbar, we will see that the soundbar is wrapped within foam. This will ensure that the soundbar is protected while it's being delivered to you. These are all the contents. I received a remote, some wires, some HDMI cables, two satellite rear speakers, some holders, the speaker itself and the subwoofer. The subwoofer is pretty large and I guess it's above 250 watts. soundbar is in a rectangular shape and this is all about it. It has a Dolby Atmos level in front of it and it's branding on the left side. These are the holders and the cables that come with the soundbar. The sound quality that this soundbar gives and produces is quite admirable at this budget. I was thinking of buying a wired Sony home theater but then I saw that Zebronix was providing Dolby Atmos at this price range. So I thought why not try and test it. And after trying my mind was blown. It was absolutely the best budget home theater that supports Dolby Atmos. It didn't feel one bit that it was cheap and the sound was not bad at all like it blew my mind away the Dolby Atmos surround sounds everything was crystal clear the only con that I faced was that the rear satellite speakers were quite low in volume I had to reach to their customer support to get them replaced but after that everything works fine the shortcoming is that if you place your speakers too close to the routers your Wi-Fi routers then you might see some crackling noises coming out from the satellite speakers but I had dealt with it easily by placing the router somewhere else. This was all I had to tell you about the home theater. I hope you like my review so be sure to share the video, subscribe to my channel and like and comment. Thank you everyone and until then goodbye.